six I slept pretty well um, I had really weird dreams I was like studying abroad in France and I was staying in this apartment and I was almost done studying I only had a couple days left and I came home and there was this guy in the apartment and I was like that's not right and um, he was very threatening not like trying to kill me immediately but definitely later was trying to kill me and um, one of my other roommates came home and he helped kind of keep the guy off for a bit um and then the guy's like i'm not gonna hurt you go ahead call 911 and i'm like uh -huh, it's 999 i know this and so i am um, at least in like the uk right i don't know if france is the same anyways and i called 999 and i couldn't figure out where my address was like it was like gone from my brain and then they managed to get a hold of i guess campus security because it was close to the school and campus security called so I gave them the address and I tried calling 999 again because like this guy was trying to kill me um and I like got all the way down and it was like a huge walk up I like got all the way downstairs and like I come out into the lawn and there's like this random guy there and he just like takes the guy out and he was like he was like pretty aggressive and he's like this is why I don't work for campus security anymore <laughs> because I wasn't allowed to do this then yeah so that was weird and yeah, so that was nice, and then there was like weird stuff going on too, cause like boats and I don't know, it was weird. And then I had another dream and Bob Saget was there, uh, and then I had another dream where I was in like a hospital or a school or something, and these guys came in and just started shooting. I think it was a hospital, and just like started shooting everybody, like everybody. And the only reason I survived was because I managed to convince them that I was like cousin of like the head guy don't know how he believed that but i got treated super well which was great but also everybody was dying i don't know very very weird dreams and i woke up this morning because somebody decided to do their laundry before eight o'clock like probably closer to like just after seven and that machine is loud and it like shakes half the house when it's like in its spin cycle so that's nice of them Yay, but I slept pretty well. I feel a lot better than yesterday because I was like in bed at like 9 or something. But I'm going to go now because I need to drink my breakfast drink and then get ready to face the day. It is August 4th. I need to remember to call my cousin because it's her birthday. And by call I mean text. But yeah, so that's what I'm up to today. It's supposed to be nice. Supposed to get up to 31. I'm going. Uh, well, hello. Super cool party people. It is the afternoon it is 4 30 right now i didn't get on my break till 4 so the person who normally relieves me she was going on a charter with uh someone and then going to pick up our other skipper at a nearby island where he works and assured me we will be back no later than 2 30. so somebody at 2 30 was like oh do you need a break and i'm like oh no no they should be back any minute now and then it got really busy and then it was 310 and I'm like where are they and then time kept taking by and I was busy and there was nobody who could really cover me and I hadn't eaten since I had my breakfast drink this morning actually I think I might have another one because I'm like dying and um then finally I saw the boat just before four and I was like ready to pass out because I was so hungry and like not didn't stop at all and so I'm really annoyed so it's now 4 30 like I said I'm on break until 6 and I go back for half an hour which is nice but I'm still mad about it <laughs> like you know you have to relieve me and so maybe when they say hey we want to go to XYZ and do XYZ say hey I have to relieve in the store or maybe hey can we radio so that we make sure that and he gets a break. Oh, my battery's about to die. Just like me a little bit. I'll check it with you later. I need to eat more food. I'm dying. Alrighty, so I am home now. It is quarter. Oh, that is not high enough. It is quarter to ten to nine. Um, oh my body, it hurts. Um, 
after work I went down to Le Cherbert, uh because we're doing Secret Santa and I needed to get some crafting supplies to make the Secret Santa thing and so I have now done that and so I have a little tote in the corner that will help me get that done. I know what I'm gonna do. Well, I know what I want to do. We'll see if it turns out in from my head on the thing the way I want it to. Um, and I think the shower now. Everybody's like going to the other house to watch a movie, but tomorrow somebody's birthday, so I'm gonna have to be like super social tomorrow. And um, I can't do two days of social in a row, to be completely honest. So I'm not. I'm gonna do one day. And right now I think I'm gonna shower because I desperately need to because I feel like I super stink because I probably do today was a long day and I am tired from it and I should probably eat food but I'm like not wanting to <laughs> good enough reason so yeah I think I'm gonna jump in the shower and then either do some more writing I did do some writing on my break which was nice or um go to sleep or work on my secret Santa project all are valid options. I think I want the sleep right now, so we'll see. Ugh. Yeah, I definitely need to shower. Shower first, then contemplate the next steps. I don't think I'm gonna cook food, because, um, I don't want to. I should. I probably won't. That's bad, though, because, like, all I've eaten today is, like, some pasta and two breakfast drinks. Ah, okay, I need to stop rambling, and I definitely need to go shower, because I'm just sweating like crazy you know when you're just having a day and then like it just keeps getting worse it's not even like it's not to be dramatic or anything but i'm like everybody's socializing they went to watch a movie i decided not to go because i'm like <sighs> have a long day a little grumpy still and i can only socialize one day in a row i can't do two or i'll be exhausted so i had a shower i haven't eaten dinner and i was like you know what would really be great at the end of the day my vanilla ice cream that I bought and I just went to go to the freezer to get out my ice cream and instead of taking the other girls ice cream over to the house for the movie somebody took mine I'm really I'm kind of upset right now because I was like oh man that is the perfect thing that will make me feel better today and they're probably gonna eat all my ice cream uh yeah yeah I know it's just such a simple thing but after a day like today, and also it being the same person who was back super late and why I didn't get my break until like four that took the ice cream. Yeah, I'm, I am unimpressed. I am done with this day. I, I know I'm whiny about ice cream, but it's just a whole lot. Like a blah day like I had, and then I was just like, that'll, that'll be good. And nope, took my ice cream. It's not even like I can eat the other girl's ice cream because that's a fancy ice cream. I just wanted my vanilla ice cream. And I will be very sad if they don't realize it and they just eat my ice cream because they are going to buy me ice cream because I had like three scoops out of it. Like, and I mean like I ate the top layer. <clears throat> okay, I'm going to try to write, see if that'll make me feel better, listen to music. And I think I figured out the design for my secret Santa thing. I just need to confirm that something is a literal thing not a figurative thing before I start on it so I'll do that tomorrow hopefully <sighs> but yeah I'm pretty grumpy now I was like had a bad day started to get over it because I had good time on the share bear and now just my ice cream I'm not gonna lie I'm still upset about the ice cream I thought I'd get over it I had some chips I wrote a bunch of my fanfic I think I've written probably like 1200 words today total maybe a little bit more but I'm still mad about the ice cream it's funny too because like I bought the ice cream for my birthday and I never ate it because I wasn't craving it and I had some the other day because I was having a bad day and um yeah I'm still mad about it you know when you're like just obsessively mad about something and like nothing will resolve that that's me right now the ice cream anyway I'm good I, I think I've said ice cream more times than one should in any paragraph or whatever video clip perhaps but I'm gonna go now because it's just about 10 o'clock I'm tired I had a long day. I didn't really eat a lot of food today, which is not a good thing, but that's fine. Tomorrow's another day. Hopefully tomorrow will be a better day. Um, yeah, that's it. I'm going to sleep. Thank you for coming along on today's adventure, and I will see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.